Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to Nine Balls Review of the Nostalgia Electronics Retro Series Pop-Up Hot Dog Toaster. This thing grills hot dogs and buns all at the same time. It's summertime. Let's review this, see if it works, and if it does, this thing's awesome. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, and if you want to support my videos, go to patreon.com slash nine balls. All right, so I'm just gonna get right onto the review, and this thing looks pretty cool. Um, it's actually lightweight, it looks like it would weigh a lot, but it's kind of a shiny plastic, it kind of looks like metal, and then you have your metal top here. All right, so I got the buns, I have the buns, and um, right here. <laughs> and I'm gonna put them in the side. Oh, when, I, when I saw this thing, I was just like, I couldn't believe it. This thing is awesome. It actually works. Because, uh, you know, I don't eat hot dogs all the time, but in the summertime, I think uh, this would be a cool thing to have. So, here are my turkey dogs. Put one in there, one in there. And you just press down. All right, look inside the toaster oven. I don't know if you can see that. You can see the hot elements heating up there. And I can definitely feel it. It's pretty hot. And I'm just gonna read a little bit of the instructions here. So you have your cooking settings. You have low and high. You have the hot dog basket. You have a crumb catcher. It's actually on high right now. I'm gonna turn it on like a three and a half and it has a cord uh, you can hide the cord on the bottom of the toaster the hot dog basket comes out and the crumb catcher also comes out so how to operate always make sure the cord is away from any water set desired setting press lever down to start cooking when cooking has completed the basket will automatically pop up that's pretty cool to shorten the cooking time simply turn the heat knob to the lighter setting or all the way uh, to heat setting one. To stop cooking before cycle is completed, there's a stop button on the side. And unplug the appliance, allow the unit to cool. So I'm just gonna wait till this pops up and try it out, see if this actually works. So far, um, it's working great. Like the center is really hot, super hot. The sides, as you might expect, are a lot cooler because that just, you know, you just wanna toast your bun. Oh, it's already done. It's crazy. Um, just kind of looking at it, the bun isn't necessarily toasted yet. I'm gonna pop it down again. Um, I like my hot dogs kind of well cooked, so uh, I'm gonna put it down again and see if I can get it cooked a little bit better. All right, so a couple things come to mind um, with the buns. Um, try to put two in there; it's really difficult. So you have two hot dogs, but you only have, you know, one uh, bun, and that's actually burning right now. So I gotta pop that up. Um, just the sides are burning and you definitely want to unplug it. You're kind of tempted to put like a fork down there to try to get these things out um, Don't do that, especially when it's on um, The hot dog looks done now. All right, so it's ready to eat um, I just want to show you the hot dog. You can see little kind of burn marks on the outside. So here we go One bun's toasted, so that's ready to eat And not too bad it doesn't taste bad Tastes cooked all the way through, warm, or actually hot. Uh, the bun could have been toasted just a little bit better. It's on. There's some pieces that are kind of burnt, but I think with a little practice with the adjustments, you know, the, the low to high setting, you could probably get that down right. So nowhere near as good as just a regular barbecue grill. Um, I think that's your best bet. Just put it on the grill. Um, this is more of like a novelty. It's fun. Um, if you are just want to have a quick hot dog, I think this is the way to go. I think it's actually a, a pretty cool item. Uh, yeah, so if you like this idea, I'd say go for it. It's not gonna be like the best hot dog you've ever had in your life, but it definitely cooks it pretty well. And it cooks it very, very quickly with minimal cleanup. So thanks for watching my videos. If you like them, please subscribe. And if you wanna support them, go to patreon.com slash nine balls. All right, thanks for watching.